There are a lot of crazy plant tricks that really work. I will introduce you to four of them in this video. You're about to learn what matches and cinnamon have to do with it. I use these tricks on my plants regularly because they work so incredibly well. For the first trick we need eggs, because when you eat eggs in the future you shouldn't throw away the eggshell. Instead put them in a coffee grinder like this and pulverize them. If you don't have a coffee grinder you can also use a mortar. In the end it should be a really fine powder. With this done you can put the powder into a slightly larger bowl. To the two eggshells you should now add a liter of water. Just add it to the eggshells and then stir it in properly until everything is well mixed together. It should then stand for about 12 hours. Then pour it through a sieve and mix it with water before watering your plants. I put 900 milliliters of water together with 100 milliliters of the liquid and water my flowers with it about every 3 months. This way the flowers get some nutrients from the eggshells and you still could use them instead of just throwing them straight into the rubbish. If you also want to do something good for your plants grab some matches. Don't just put them in your plants but dissolve them in some water first. The reason for this is the components of the match head. Take 250 milliliters of water and 8 to 10 of these matches. Now put them in the water and stir them a little in between. After a while you can see that the match head slowly dissolves here and the components pass into the water. Let it stand for about an hour. That should be enough. After that you will see that the water has turned clear. You can now pull the matches out of the water and dispose of them. The important components are now in the water. These are mainly sulfur, magnesium and phosphorus. This will give your plant a really nice root system and nice green leaves. To achieve this water your plants regularly every few weeks with this water. But if you now say that you don't want to waste matches on this then you should take a closer look at the next trick. Because here we use tea bags for our plants. There are two ways to do this. Let's start with the first one. You drink tea regularly and of course you have the tea bag over when they are ready. Instead of simply throwing them away you should not put them in your plants but hang them in a watering can. This is because other ingredients from the tea bag can dissolve in the water and thus pass into the water. And in tea we also find many important ingredients for our plants. The teein contained in tea disinfects your plants and fights pests. After the old tea bag has been in the water for several hours you can take it out and water your plant with it. It is best to do this alternately. So once with normal water and the next time again with a little tea water. You can even do this in your garden. You can bury it directly but without a tea bag as it is not biodegradable. Or take the old tea leaves out of the bag and spread them around your plant. Depending on what kind of tea you drink it has different effect. Black tea disinfects and strengthens the plant. Green tea has a positive effect on the soil and herbal tea strengthens the plant through the herbs it contains. So instead of just throwing away tea bags you can still use them for this. And you can even use cinnamon for your house plants because this also has several advantages. Let's start with the application. You should sprinkle ordinary cinnamon powder on the soil of your plants. A small amount is enough. In fact you can fight mold and bacteria on your plants. You can even get rid of parasite infestations. Cinnamon also helps to build a strong root system. And probably the best reason is that cinnamon kills the larva of fungus gnats. By the way did you already know the incredible trick why you should spread Vaseline on your cooker? Click on the video on the screen now to watch it.